If you saw my review on board Edelweiss Air, you'd know that I wasn't originally booked on this flight. I had a 55 minute layover in Zurich and was scheduled to connect on the Swiss Airlines flight to Vienna, numbered LX 1578, but due to a big delay on the Edelweiss flight I missed it, so I was immediately rebooked on Austrian Airlines flight 570 operated by an Airbus A320. And I totally lucked out with this flight since it happened to be operated by Oscar, Echo, Lima, Bravo, Oscar. This aircraft is known for sporting a 1980s retro livery. For me, who doesn't fly super often compared to other flight reviewers, it's always quite an opportunity to fly in one of these eye-catching paint schemes. The aircraft will fly from Zurich to Vienna, and time should be about an hour. Thank you for joining me on this trip to Austria, and let's get into the video. Over there, you can see an Icelandair Boeing 737 MAX 8 headed for most likely Reykjavik. And then right here, that's my A320. It's in a very nice retro livery. And interestingly, this aircraft didn't always have this livery. Up until February 2019, it had the standard Austrian paint scheme. Over there behind us is a Swiss Airlines Airbus A220. I do not know where that's going. Also, you can see an Antonov AN-124, that's quite a sight. And also from here, you can see the Edelweiss Airbus A340 that I flew on. And finally, right beside us, we've got another Airbus A320. This one's operated by Lufthansa, it's going to Frankfurt. One thing that makes this one different from mine is that this one has sharklets.
Nein, so ist aus der Zurück nach Wien. Äh, wir haben jetzt die Flugverwaltung abschließen können, eigentlich pünktlich. Allerdings äh, gibt es Reste. Das heißt, äh, wir müssen noch 20 Minuten warten, bis wir hier die Triebwerke starten dürfen. Ich möchte mich für Ihre Geduld und Ihr Verständnis bedanken. Und hoffe, Sie fühlen sich in der Zwischenzeit trotzdem schon so wohl wie möglich mit uns hier an Bord. Dankeschön. Ladies and Gentlemen. Good afternoon, welcome on board out of your flight deck on this uh, service from Austrian uh, direction back to Vienna. On time, we have finished our flight preparations. Nevertheless, uh, we have some restrictions on the route to Vienna. Uh, so uh, we have a predetermined uh, startup time. That means we still have to wait until we're allowed to start around uh, 20 minutes from now on. I apologize, hope for your understanding and your patience, and nevertheless, uh, meanwhile, I hope you feel already as comfortable. Yeah, no,
Welcome everyone to the country of Austria. Quite a gem in the sky, Austrian Airlines is. Their hard product in general is average and almost identical to Lufthansa in terms of passenger comfort. More on that later. But the service is also just like Lufthansa, not surprising since Austrian is in the Lufthansa group, with nothing more than a cup of water and a chocolate free for economy. Anything else you need to buy from the onboard menu. And yes, normally I'd expect a complimentary drink or snack selection, but for a flight that lasted less than an hour, this was perfectly fine. But the main highlight of this flight was the cabin crew themselves. They were no doubt some of the friendliest and most helpful flight attendants I have seen in a while. All I can say is that they made this flight go from good to somewhat great. About the seat comfort though, I was never uncomfortable during the 54 minutes of flight time, but while the legroom was nice, the seats didn't have much cushioning on them. I just hope that Austrian doesn't use this plane on flights that last longer than 3 hours, because I would not want to be sitting in those seats for that long. Final score is 8 out of 10. Thank you Austrian Airlines for the fantastic flight to your home country, and I'll definitely be flying with you again when I can. Thank you.